What's up, YouTube? Back with the next video. Ting on your what? Your head tops, bruh. Okay, look, look. Hear me out. Hear me out. Listen. Now, confidence is one thing. Being cocky is another thing. And I'm encouraging both, okay? Because they got to be used in the right situations. Now, I'm not telling you to walk around and act like the world owes you something and be rude to strangers and shit like that. There's, you have, Use your common sense. You're a grown man, right? I'm not telling you to do that. But you need to have a certain je ne sais quoi to you, right? Everybody says they don't like a cocky man. Everybody says that, ah, oh, he's too cocky, fuck him, and blah, 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 and this and that. But here's the thing. Actions speak louder than words. <laughs> and everybody knows how to say the right fucking thing. But in the heat of the moment, people will tell on themselves, right? In the heat of the moment, people will prove their words either false or real. Everybody says they don't like this kind of guy. But why is it that that guy has everything that you want and more? Why does he have the partner that you have? Why does he get the respect that you never fucking get? Because you're so nice. Why is it? Why is he getting to his goals faster than you? Why does everybody respect him? Why is it? I'll tell you why. Hey, everybody's going to tell you what they want and don't want. But trust me, they will show you way better than they can tell you. Okay? Listen, your confidence is going to come from repetition. First and foremost, if you ain't putting in no work and you're being arrogant, I mean, your arrogance is funny, right? But if you, re if you really had them long days, early mornings, long nights, you did what you had to do instead of what you wanted to do. You have all the right to be fucking cocky, to be fucking arrogant because you fucking know where you're going, bro. A lot of these guys out here, they driving. We don't know where they're going. They ain't got no direction. It's one thing to jump in the car and drive. But if I went northwest, I'm going to be in Seattle. Seattle's great, but I want to go to Toronto. That's northeast, right? If you have that kind of direction in your life and you're putting in the work necessary and you're sacrificing, you have all the right to be like that, sir. And anybody that has a problem with it is because they're not putting in the same fucking work as you do. And they want you to, quote unquote, humble yourself. Of course you could be fucking humble and still believe in yourself. Come on, bro. Are you shitting me? You think the best athletes in the world are running around saying, oh, shucks, it was nothing. You think Cristiano Ronaldo is in the World Cup saying, uh, I hope I get a goal today? No, fuck no. That motherfucker's in the locker room saying, I'm going to absolutely destroy these niggas because they can't see me. And I'm putting in more work and I look better and I'll take your bitch too. Mwah. You got to have that kind of energy to you, bro. Listen, all these nice guys get mistaken for beta. They get mistaken for pussy. They get taken advantage of. And people don't appreciate them. They get walked all over. You want to be that? You want motherfuckers to walk all over you? Hey, it's all good. Even if they don't like you, at least they know they can't try you. Right. That's fine. Hey, I would rather motherfuckers not like me and not try me than like me and try to play me for pussy, bro. I'm telling you straight up. Straight like that. Every time, I'm going to say this from a personal standpoint, right? Every time I showed weakness and beta and niceness, I always got fucking played. I never got what I wanted. I'm not saying be bad to people, not be wrong to people, but say no if it's not beneficial to you. You hear me? If it's not beneficial, if the shit don't make no sense, say no. Shit, if someone want to question your ability, you tell them, no, fuck that. I can't do that. Nah, what you mean? And every time I came with that kind of energy, trust me, I got everything I wanted and more. Trust me on that one, broski. I've experimented with that for years now. Right? A lot of people don't like me. But a lot of people know they can't try me. Maybe on the internet. But in the flesh, I'm telling you guys right now, ain't nobody ever tried me in the flesh. Ain't nobody ever came at me. No type of fun. No. Because there's a certain way you got to carry yourself. Right? And it's not just with words. It's just, man, look at next time. Look, once you get out of this video, bro, I want you to really walk around and look at some guys the way they walk. Just the way they walk. They got their held, their head held high, bro. Walk around with their dick out. Not literally because, you know, you get arrested for that, right? <laughs> but there's certain guys, like, they just walk a certain way. And it's because, like, damn, like, you just put in the work, whatever his craft is. And that should be you as well. Be alpha, be dominant, be confident. And if they don't like your confidence, it's because they ain't putting the same work as you, bro. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Stay locked in and stay motivated.